Okay, here we go. Another slew of updates to this night game project. Here we go. So first of all, we have doors. We have a nice opening animation. Block your way. Progressing too quickly. Added some new death animations for the enemies. All kinds of new sound effects everywhere. Make it a little bit more lively like that. Okay, no, I was too too hasty killing those slimes. Let's see if there's a snow slime coming. Here we go. We can just step through the door. I don't have any like doors blocking hits or anything like that yet, so this will work. I just basically have when you kill an enemy, it'll just find the closest door and and try to open it like that. There we go. Get this door for me, please. Whoops. Okay, whoops. Can trigger the door opening multiple times there. That's a good bug to fix. Some enemies sometimes sink to the floors, but I'll fix that. Okay, the simulation for the enemies is still run basically all the time. Even when they're out of the screen, so I'll definitely get a better frame rate by just optimizing that. Okay, I missed my chance to bait this knight here. Just have to wait for him to come back. I see some enemies top, top there. So by default the enemies kind of have an AI to patrol, so they will just like walk and if they encounter a solid wall they will just turn around and keep walking. And the slimes also have like one out of 255 chance at uh, jumping, so the jump will kind of move them forward. Whoops. So yeah, that's what you get when you open the door based on the enemy position. Okay, so one other thing, let me just open this wall here, show that. So I implemented the kind of rudimentary basics of a shop where you can spend these Dark Souls inspired currency that you get by killing enemies and it will look like something like that. You would get like maybe a single item you got spent your money on or something useful and just kind of choose it randomly. So yeah, that's basically what I have right now.